Pokemon all about poster inside Eevee. This book, this $7.99 book contains absolutely everything you need to know to become an Eevee expert. It says so at the very end. Uh-oh, that's not true anymore. How's that poster? Oh good, I love when they're folded. Is this book more evidence that there will never be another Eeveelution? I mean, they wouldn't just outdate a book that just came out, would they? This is from... 2021! Imagine if they introduced a new Eevee in the next games. People would be... People would love it, but people who bought this book would be... And they wouldn't upset their fan base, would they? So what deep Eevee secrets are contained within these pages? Is there some never-before-seen lore? Some highly technical strategy details? Biological diagrams of every Eevee and how they work? Will this book answer the question, Is Vaporeon truly the best Pokémon to f Seven reasons Glaceon is the greatest! Look, Glaceon is clearly the best Eevee Lucian. There is no denying it at this point. This contains every detail you need to know about Eevee, and it says Glaceon is the greatest. Spitting straight facts. Also, I see what they did there. Glaceon is the greatest. It's, what's the word? Alliterative? So I wonder what the others are. Espeon is exciting. Sylveon is superb. Jolteon is just incredible. Flareon is fierce. Vaporeon is very cool. Umbreon is impressive. Um, impressive? Umbreon is impressive? Is that, is that how you're trying to say it? Leafeon is so incredible. Leafeon, guys. Leafeon is so incredible that it got the best alliteration. It's not an alliteration. <laughs> they didn't even try. Here, Leafeon is the lewd is the first thing that came to my mind. Oh, because ludicrous. Leafeon is ludicrous. Leafeon is, is luscious. Leafy would have been good. Leafeon is leafy. That's fine. Leafeon is lovely, would have been fine too, but no, we got so incredible. <laughs> Scholastic. What makes it even worse is that they already used incredible because the Jolteon is just incredible. Ay ay. Well, maybe there's some like good reasons in here. You know, seven reasons Glaceon is the greatest. There's probably some really good facts in here. If your freezer breaks, Glaceon can chill your food for you. Glaceon's body may be cold as ice, but it still has a warm heart. They could have done something cool. Right, Leafeon. Leafeon's genetic makeup is similar to that of a plant, if only all plants were as fun to play with. That's a fair point. Um, lithe Leafeon is great at dodging attack. What, what the heck is a lithe? What does lithe mean? Hang on. It's a word to describe bodies that are thin, supple, and graceful. They could have done Leafeon is lithe! That's a weird word no one knows, but like you already used incredible! Leafeon is a true friend. You can always count on it to take action to help his pals out. Uh, all the Eevees do that! That's not a, that's not a Leafeon explicit thing, unless it is a Leafeon explicit thing. Is Leafeon the only one that like makes friends? A true team player, Leafeon does well in double battles as part of a larger squad. Because Leafeon needs help, so much help to be any good. As its trainer, you'll never have to worry about losing Sylveon. The ribbons it ties around you will keep it close by. And they say Vaporeon's good. Vaporeon, oh boy. Wow, it's a fish. What do you got? Why are you very cool? Has gills and mad skills. When ice cream melts, it's a bad thing. But when Vaporeon melts, it's amazing and can make it invisible. I you have to go and bring ice cream into this. Oh, I'm sad. Jolteon is not the greatest. Jolteon is just incredible. Because Jolteon can use its anger in a productive way. When it gets mad, its feelings can motivate it to step in and save the day. Again, like, that's, that's, that's like all the Eevee illusions. Like a flash of lightning, Jolteon can burst into action in a split second. Split this book in a second. Jolteon isn't afraid when it sees another angry Pokemon. It didn't flinch when faced with Cryogonal's rage. Is that a specific thing? Maybe, maybe the earlier part, we'll talk about it. That famous Jolteon, it's, it's, no, no. Why, why is Cryogonal being brought up? No one likes being reminded of it. Flareon is fierce! Because Flareon's soft, fuzzy fur is fun to pet. So soft, so fuzzy, so fun! <laughs> when there's smoke, there's fire, and maybe a Flareon behind it all. Flareon will burn your house down. Or it'll just help you cook. That's why Flareon is fierce. It's household chores. The orb between Espeon's eyes is better than any battery. It stores the sun's energy and powers up Espeon's moves, but can you attach electrical wires to it? If not, why are you comparing it to a battery? 
like it's filling with psychic energy. You can't hook that up to a battery, unless you can. And there's like Pokemon science we don't know about yet. Espeon is so swift and has such strong senses that it can run through a razor leaf attack without getting hit by a single leaf, can it? Does Razor Leaf always miss Espeon? Espeon can predict the next foe's move before it strikes. I can predict too. Doesn't mean I'm always right. I bet it's gonna hit me. I should avoid that. Psychic type now. I do like seeing the difference in quality between like ancient anime and modern anime. That's, that's pretty neat. Umbreon is impressive because using its powerful psychic move, Umbreon has been known to mold and bend things to its will. Are they muddying the waters here? Does Umbreon actually learn Psychic? No. But what are you talking about, book? Umbreon's coat is so smooth and shiny, it could be the star of a shampoo commercial. But isn't the point of a shampoo commercial to say like, look, I use this shampoo, so now my hair's all nice and shiny. Not, my hair's naturally nice and shiny because I'm an Umbreon. Buy the shampoo I don't need to use. Am I overthinking a children's book? Is that what's... That's what's happening, isn't it? Many people get a golden ring when they get married, but when Eevee has a trainer who adores it and it evolves into Umbreon, its body gets covered in golden rings. I suppose it's not wrong. And Eevee itself. Would you look at that? It, it evolves a bunch, bunch of Eevees. It, May's Eevee was great. Uh, oh, the Eevee is awesome! I didn't realize they had a page like this for Eevee too. Eevee is awesome, like, it's also not quite alliterative, but it's close. It's, it's close. Uh, Eevee is fluffy. So fluffy. Imagine watching, like, a 500 Pokemon Facts video. And one of them was Eevee is fluffy. So fluffy. There you go, that, that's all of it. What is the Glaceon Ice type symbol? They put, it's water, fire, electric, it's plant. Magic ball, moon, star, because dark. It's like a, a fairy flower, like fairy map. That's literally, that is literally Glaceon's tail. Why would the type symbol be a body part of a single Pokemon? Why not a snowflake? That it, it's a snowflake in like everything else, or like an ice crystal? No, you got a scarf tail. I have a mighty suspicion that this book was not written by Pokemon scientists, but uh, by some people trying to make a quick buck. Scholastic Book Fair. Remember those? They're great. I wish they had those for adults, but every single time I go to an adult bookstore, I'm in for a surprise. 